prepare to explore. Get out of the city and into an adventure that moves the whole family. Prepare to be moved. The all-new Nissan X-Trail. On air, online, and on your smart speaker. What's the time? Time to go to Henry Post Jewelers, your watch specialist, in-store or online. SAFM News Briefing. Hello, I'm Alicia McFarlane. In breaking news, tragedy has struck a New South Wales school today. A 10-year-old boy who was reportedly disabled has died after becoming trapped under a lift. Police were called to a school in Sydney's Upper North Shore this afternoon, but the boy sadly died at the scene. There are four fires burning at emergency level in Queensland this afternoon. In excess of 50 homes have been lost across the state's fire grounds. Rob Bonnewell from the state's Fire and Emergency Service has told the ABC things could have been a lot worse if it wasn't for the combined efforts of their personnel, the New South Wales RFS and police. We might have to call upon those combined efforts again into the future. But um, fingers crossed we'll get ahead of it. Gold Coast Police are investigating several suspicious fires which appear to have been deliberately lit. The AFP is calling on the Australian public to help find a missing toddler. 18-month-old Walker Duggan has been missing for about two weeks and is believed to be with his mother Kylie. The pair could be travelling through New South Wales towards Queensland or Victoria. Some Australians in Gaza are being told to go to the Rafah border crossing following reports it may open to foreign nationals. The US has confirmed 68 trucks carrying vital medicines and food have made their way into the enclave, while Prime Minister Anthony Albanese is urging Aussies in Lebanon to consider leaving as he's worried the conflict could spread. A plea for Australians in Lebanon if they wish to leave, to leave now. After this, there is no turning back. You sip the red can, the story ends. You sip the black can, you enter dreamland. And I show you just how good the truth can taste. <laughs> Take the Pepsi Max taste challenge. To sport, Dane Zorko will play a 12th season at Brisbane next year with the Lions offering the 34-year-old a new deal. And still on footy, former Sydney Ruckman Sam Naismith is getting a second chance in the AFL. He joins Richmond as a delisted free agent after an impressive run in the VFL. The 31-year-old says his plan all along was to get back to the top tier. It's been sort of pretty tough times uh, through that journey and um, this just validates everything that I've worked hard for during that time and everyone that supported me. Stone Coast down to 5 degrees tonight. Tomorrow, cloudy again and 19 degrees. Stay informed with the Listener News Channel on Alexa, a mix of breaking news and in-depth analysis from all your favourite listener shows. Just say, Alexa, play news from Listener News. 